Hey, it's Ted, and this is Upward Facing Dog Pose. So, you're on your hands and different from Cobra. Cobra Pose, you're on the floor, on your mat. Upward Facing Dog, your arms are straight and your feet are planted. The only things that touch the mat are your hands and your feet. Typically, you come to this through Chaturanga. So I will take chaturanga first. Chaturanga, you're bending the arms and then I'll flip over the toes and push the arms straight. Some people are going to be straighter. Some people are going to have a hard time with the shoulders pulling back and it's a very, very intense back bend. So I'm, well, I'm resting when I drop the knees down there, but arms are straight. Pull the shoulders back. Notice as I pull the shoulders back, then I'm also externally rotating the shoulders. Push up, engage the thighs so your legs are strong and see how that pushes me forward a little? That's the resistance I want to move into for me and then push up and back. Now, by the way, that is a very intense pose and not something you just want to go into right away. I want to explain a few different things for you. But essentially, if you can, you want to lift up as high as you can and pull the shoulders back. So we're going to go into it again. And so as you come into it, so from Chaturanga, you're down, then you roll over the toes, lift up. Because my back is a bit more flexible, I can actually straighten the arms. I'm a little bit forward. Sometimes you'll see people that are sort of super straight, shoulders back, lifting the heart. And then if that's okay for you, then you can sort of look up a little bit. But I wouldn't strain. I wouldn't strain ever really in the yoga poses here. Sometimes it's nice to drop one hip down. Sometimes it's nice to drop the other hip down. But it's a hard pose. Lift up, pull the shoulders back. Take one more inhale. And then drop to the knees, child's pose. <sighs> so again, same thing. These, this is just to break down the poses for you so that as you start to flow, you can think about these little extra things. It took me so long to be able to pull the shoulders back just because I'm a bigger guy and, and it, my shoulders were tight forever and my upper back was tight forever. And so it was all about pulling the shoulders back at that point. So just keep working on that. Thanks so much. See you next time. <laughs>